In today's gospel from the first chapter of John's gospel, John the Baptist points Jesus out to two of his own disciples and tells them that there is the Lamb of God. The two disciples, one of whom was Andrew, the brother of the man who would become St. Peter, began to follow Jesus who asked him, what are you looking for? Do you know what they said? Hello, I'm Father James Kabicki of the Apostleship of Prayer, and the response of Andrew is interesting. He simply asked Jesus where he was staying. In other words, he wanted to spend time with Jesus in order to get to know him better. You know, that's what prayer really is, spending time with Jesus and coming to know him better through his word, living in the Gospels, and through the Holy Spirit speaking quietly in the depths of our hearts as we listen. Andrew was so excited about the possibility of knowing Jesus that he went to get his brother Peter. And when Jesus saw Peter, he said, You are Simon, son of John. You will be called Cephas. Cephas, we are told, is translated Peter, which means rock. It's as though Jesus looked at Peter and saw not only that impetuous fisherman standing before him, but also his potential. He saw that Peter had the potential to become the rock on which he would build his church. That too is part of prayer, coming before Jesus and having him see our potential, and then giving us the grace to attain it. And the ultimate potential, our ultimate goal, is to become saints, just like Peter, in whom the world may not have seen much, but in whose eyes Jesus saw the first pope.